In this video, we are going to talk about International Institute of Information Technology, Hyderabad, also called as IIIT Hyderabad, and its entrance exam for postgraduate programs, which is PGEE. This is a great opportunity for students who could not qualify GATE or have a low GATE score. Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. My name is Varun. I am currently an MTech student at IIT Bombay in the Department of Electrical Engineering. Let me first start by giving you a short introduction about IIIT Hyderabad. IIIT Hyderabad offers postgraduate programs with emphasis on technology. The institute facilitates interdisciplinary research and has several joint collaborations with the industry. It has several advanced research centers in the field of artificial intelligence, robotics, VLSI, communications, etc. The institute also has a great placement record for its master's program. Now let's get to the type of programs which are offered by IIIT Hyderabad. The institute offers four MTech programs which include Computer Science Engineering, Computer Science and Information Technology, Computer Aided Structural Engineering and Product Design and Management. It also offers five MS programs which include Computer Science Engineering, Electronics and Communication Engineering, Bioinformatics, Civil Engineering and IT in Building Science. MTech program is based on coursework and has a fixed duration of two years, whereas the MS program has some coursework along with the research thesis and its duration can vary between two to three years. The institute also offers several PhD programs which you can check from the link in the description. For admissions to all of these programs, IIIT Hyderabad conducts a postgraduate entrance examination which is also called PGEE. This is a computer based examination which is held at multiple centers across many cities. The exam has two components. First one is the general aptitude test and second one is the subject test. Each of these tests are of 90 minute duration. The syllabus for the general aptitude test is basic aptitude, logical reasoning and basic questions on computers and mathematics. In the subject test, the candidate has to appear either for computer science or civil engineering depending on their graduating discipline. For the MTech program, the candidate will have to give both the test that is the aptitude test and the subject test. An admission will be based on the performance in these tests. For the MS and PhD programs, the candidate only has to give the general aptitude test. Candidates will be further shortlisted based on their performance in the general aptitude test for a subject interview. Admissions for MS and PhD will only depend on their performance in the interview. For the MTech program, applications are invited once a year for the July intake. Whereas for the MS and PhD programs, applications are invited twice a year for January and July intake. PGEE is conducted in the month of April and its applications start in the month of February, usually after the GATE examination. Please go through the detailed eligibility list for the exam. I will also provide all the important links in the description below. Now let us discuss the placement record of the institute. The institute has a great placement record with several national and multinational companies as their past recruiters. You can check the previous year placement record. These placement stats have been obtained from their website and shows that MTech and MS programs have close to 100% placement. Let me give you some tips which will help you in deciding whether to apply for this examination. I think you should definitely apply for this examination since its portion is very much similar to GATE depending on the program you choose to apply. If you are going for the MTech program, then the portion of PGEE is very much similar to the portion of GATE Computer Science or Civil Engineering. And if you are going for the MS program, then you will have to give an aptitude test followed by a subject interview, in which also your GATE preparation will be helpful. This is a great opportunity for a student who has already appeared for GATE but could not qualify or has a low GATE score. The institute also provides monthly stipend for its MTech and MS programs similar to IITs and NITs. It also has a great placement record as we discussed earlier. The fees for the programs at IIIT Hyderabad are definitely higher as compared to fees at IITs or NITs. This is the end of the video. I hope you got to know more about IIIT Hyderabad and its entrance examination. If you have any further questions then please let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.